Let's delve into Katerina Sinyakova's training regimen and explore the element that have propelled her to the status of a former world number one in doubles, making her a formidable presence in the WTA. Her training methods offer formidable insights that can be applied by aspiring players, encompassing a comprehensive workout approach that spans both on-court and off-court disciplines. Lastly, she does some agility and quickness drills. The sport requires players to dash around the court, changing direction in the blink of an eye. These drills help Katerina stay on her toes, react swiftly, and retriever her opponent's throws at her. Then there's a precision factor. When you are playing tennis at a high level, every step counts. Lateral movements on ladders and cones demand precise foot placement, which translates directly to better positioning during games. It's not just about reaching the ball. It's about being in the right place at the right time. Katerina's commitment to these deals shows she is in it for a long haul. She knows that improving her footwork is a continuous journey. By including these drills, she's not just talking the walk, she's walking and run. The walk to be the best she can on the tennis court. Now, the resistant bounds create added resistance during footwork exercise, making her muscles to work harder. This builds uh, strength and power in muscles responsible to, uh, for her footwork, allowing her to generate explosive movement on the court. It's akin to strengthen an uh, engine that powers her agility and speed. Moreover, these resistant drills improve her stability and balance. Tennis players often find themselves in an awkward position during a match, and having a strong and stable base is essential to recover quickly and maintain control over the shots. Additionally, the resistance bands help correct any biomechanical issue in her foot talk. They promote proper form of renf and reinforce the right muscles activation patterns, reducing the risk of injury caused by improper movements. She recognizes the significance of eye-hand coordination drills as a fundamental aspect of her tennis training. Tennis involves a split-second decision on sh short placement and these drills enhance her ability to react swiftly and precise for her opponent's shots, ensuring she can return them effectively. Moreover, eye-hand coordination drills sharpen her reflexes. Tennis is a fast-paced sport and the ability to respond rapidly to incoming shots is a paramount. These drills enable Katerina to develop lightning fast reaction, giving a competitive edge of her opponents. Furthermore, these drills contribute to her, her overall athleticism. They enhance her fine, uh, fine motor skills, helping her to perform intricate and controlled movement with the racket when required, such as drop shots and volleys and slice. The queen also does stretching and yoga. This practice promotes flexibility and mobility. Tennis requires a wide range of motion and maintaining limber muscles and joints is crucial to execute powerful serves, swift sprints and agile lateral movements. Stretching and yoga help prevent injuries by ensuring her body is supple and ready for the demands of the sport. Um, to add stretching and yoga aids in recovery. Tennis players often suffer during matches and intense training sessions, which can lead to muscle tightness and fatigue. Incorporating these practices into our training routine helps Katerina elevate soreness, reduce muscle tension, and recover faster, enabling her to stay at peak performance. Also, yoga fosters mental focus and relaxation. A strong core provides stability and balance, two crucial elements in tennis. It allows her to maintain an upright posture while making rapid lateral movement on the tennis court, helping her respond quickly to her opponent's shots. This stability translates into improved shot accuracy and power. Also, the core strength enhances her overall athleticism. Tennis demands explosive movements, whether it's serving, hitting down strokes, ground strokes, or hitting across the court. A strong core serves as the powerhouse of this movement, allowing her to generate more speed and 
uh, power and speed. She also does some cardio workout. Rope jumping is an exceptional cardiovascular exercise. It elevates her heart rate, improving her overall endure endurance and stamina. In tennis, matches can be grilling and physically demanding, often lasting for hours. Rope, jumps, rope jumping helps uh, ensure that Katharina maintains the necessary cardiovascular fitness to perform at her best throughout the duration of the match. Secondly, rope jumping enhances her agility and footwork. The rapid footwork movement required to jump rope translates directly to agility and quickness needed to tennis court. It hones the ability to exchange direction swiftly and maintain precise footwork are crucial for reacting to our opponent's shots effectively. It includes running. Uh, it's an excellent cardiovascular exercise also. It helps improve the overall endurance and stamina, which are essential for enjoying, enjoying long and physically demanding tennis matches. Tennis players often engage in intense rallies and long sets and solid cardiovascular base enable Katerina to maintain her energy level throughout this extended contest. Um, running enhances her leg strength and power. The explosive sprint and lateral movement required in tennis demand long leg muscles. Regular running helps to build and tone these muscles, aiding her generating the power needed to serve grand strokes and quick court coverage. Lastly, uh, she did some cycling. It's an excellent a low impact cardiovascular exercise. It allows her to elevate her heart rate and improve her endurance without placing excessive strain on her joint. This cardiovascular condition is a vital for tennis players who need to maintain a high level of stamina throughout long matches. Moreover, cycling can be enjoyable and mentally refreshing activity. Now, on the lower body, this exercise forces her leg muscles to, and joints to adapt to shifting uh, surface, improving her own court agility and injury resilience. Moreover, training and on unstable surf, uh, platforms challenge her core muscles which are vital for maintaining a strong and steady base while hitting powerful shots. By prioritizing leg stability on unstable platforms, she strengthened her foundation, ultimately contributing to her stability to improve efficiently and perform at her best in the dynamic sport of tennis. Lastly, on her upper body, tennis relies heavily on, her, on arm and shoulder strength for serving, volleying and executing ground strokes with precision. Cable excess provide variable resistance throughout the range of motion, which closely translates to the demands of her sport, helping to develop the explosive force required for effective shot. Strengthening the arms and shoulder also aids in injury prevention and ensures she can maintain her performance level consistently.